honeys, it's your girl and I'm back with another video. So Super Loved Hair sponsored this video today and I am showing you guys everything that came in the package that they have sent me and including the hair that I will be wearing in the next clip. Here we go. Now guys, this wig, this wig is a beautiful wig, a good quality wig. I really, really enjoyed styling it and as you can see, it just looks so good already and it's not even installed yet, you know. But um, not going into too much detail, I want to thank Super Love Hair for sponsoring this video. This is a 13 by 4, 24 inch wig. And you guys will see towards the end that this wig is longer than what it's actually supposed to be. I mean, my 30 inch wig was this long. And this is not even a 28 inch. This is a 24 inch girl. And it's literally the length of my 30 inch wig. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and more details to this wig and to Super Love Hair Company will be down below in the description box. So make sure you check it out if you're interested in purchasing this wig or any other wigs that they have available to sell to you guys. Bye!
new vlog it is thursday if i'm not mistaken it's thursday and i decided you know what let me start a new vlog let's keep it going let's keep it flying let's be consistent so if you're new to my channel hey welcome click the subscribe button and the post notification button which is the low bar honey if you know what i post and if you're a returning subscriber hey what it do what it is <laughs> that's right i know that's right so basically this morning or this day it's 12 o'clock i think i think it's like off post 11 actually so um i did tell you guys in the previous vlog that i am going to be getting here the next couple of weeks next couple of days and i've got two right now on my table i've got one that i need to bleach the knots for because i'm planning on installing it today i'm planning on taking out these braids today i just have a lot to do today um, so I need to bleach these knots and I'm going to show you guys how I bleach them. I just hope I do still have bleach Available because I'm not in the mood to drive to clicks just to get bleach and I'm also not in the mood to swipe my card I just I've been swiping it so much the past couple of days I want to give it a break, you know, I want to stay on the same amount for a few days because Clearly I struggle to do that um, after bleaching I'm going to be cutting my hair and um, obviously I will say uninstall it, but um, cut my hair and take out the braids and then what else do I have to do today I have to shoot a video to show you guys how I remove my glue from my um, lace um, yeah I found a new method a new and easy method but that's going to be a separate video on its own but I guess I will also sh show some clips on this vlog for people who just watch my vlogs and don't watch my other videos I know there are people like that I'm like that as well I subscribe to different people's channels for different types of things so for example I subscribe to Nessa so Nessa is a Canadian youtuber I subscribe to her for her vlogs and her makeup content everything else I don't watch I subscribe to um who else um angry um angry taicho touch i don't know how to pronounce her surname she's Ghanaian. i subscribe i subscribe to her channel for her vlogs only i don't watch her hauls i don't watch her sit down videos you know you subscribe to different people for different types of things um which is kind of bad actually i think because like you so subscribe to someone to support them but i guess also because you like certain content of theirs but anyway i'm rambling on let me get started with bleaching these nuts but first let me go check if we've got some bleach is it bleach or dye? I think I was saying dye the whole time. But anyway, let me go check if I have bleach. Is it bleach? I don't know, but let's go. Tonight is on a pilot. Yeah. It's about time for waking up. Told you I wasn't with you waking up. Now you're 
Yeah, the shortest because level there is. Here. No, it's because very, very see, short. already there is this it's level that is already very, here. Yes, yeah, so that's the shortest one, right? That is the shortest. So to that length, is it too short? It's too short, so that is not the shoulder length again. Yeah, this length is fine. This length is fine. This length. Yeah. So, so let me let me tell you something. All of this is gonna go. Mm. Right. Mm. It has to go. So it's no longer long, long, longer bob. It's fine, but this is not. Because remember that bob I did yeah. there? It was here. Mm -hmm. And I didn't like that it was that short. Mm -hmm. So I just want this one to be a bit longer. Yeah. So this is fine. It's longer than that other. Yeah. I'm good to go. Bag of money, knew I gotta have it. Savage, but I'm still a gentleman in the Cali. Atlantic, nigga, turn him in about the cabbage. Uh, and it's all family if you run up with the footage. I just put it back when I wear the Bogota. Fuck his eyes out, and I'm telling what he saw. Fuck him, I'm gonna watch y'all, I don't know if he'll talk. Get the chainsaw and I'ma saw our legs off. They know that we're a game, but they said that we're a ring. And that's a game, taking pictures of the whole team. I'm yeah. a couple trying to do a sting. Didn't live on a bike, won't stick them in a team. Trapping like the narco. narco. Got dope like Pablo. Pablo. Cut dope like Pablo. Cut dope. Chop trees with the Draco. making my way to um, Infinite Aesthetics and it's basically in Flew Street and I'm going to get my lips done! I'm so excited I've always wanted to do this and I'm so glad I'm finally doing it I've been wanting to do this since 2020 or 2019 or 2020 actually I remember and I'm finally doing it because I mean I got the opportunity to do so um, the doctor um she will be doing my lips today and she agreed to like work with me you know i told her i've been wanting to do this and she said that you know what i got you let me be your doctor let me get you a new set of lips i'm on my way there now and it is currently 11 32 my appointment is for 11 um 12 o'clock and then after getting my lips done i need to go to 
get my hair at Postnet because it has arrived. I told you guys I'm just going to be receiving wigs on wigs on wigs. So um, I didn't lie about that. Uh, I'm still really very much enjoying this hair. So yeah, as you guys can see, the lighting is not on our side right now. So I am just going to put down the camera and make my way there safely. And then um, I also need to have something to eat because I haven't had breakfast. So I'm just going to do that as well. Yo, guys, I've got a serious matter to discuss with you, hey? In terms of, like, being a student and having to find, um... Having to find, like, companies to do your in-service training at or, um... You know internships things like that like it's really stressing me out right now and i really do want to talk about it because maybe you guys can like give me insights or help me out because i know that not only do like young people watch my channel like high school and first years but i know that there's a lot of people who have graduated people who are working and people who can give me a bit of insight on this situation but anyway guys like i said let me get there safely and then i will catch you guys a bit later okay so i have arrived at the place it took me a while to get here because i came going as if i'm going to cams bay and she said that i should go towards town so i even found parking inside i didn't have to park on the road and pay for parking because i truly hate that those people literally don't give you a break like i haven't even put my car in park and they by my door waiting for me to yo those people don't let you breathe hey like about him you see but anyway i'm gonna go have quick breakfast because apparently my appointment is for 12 30 <clears throat> excuse me and it's currently 11 57 so i've got 30 minutes to have a small little breakfast i think i'm gonna end up going to Kauai and having breakfast there i'm not too sure but um yeah typically behind getting the times mixed up as usual i'm gonna try to get a picture of my nails because i still haven't posted anything um on instagram to show like my new set so i'm gonna do that and then yeah go to breakfast so let's go in here i'm sure you guys would have seen the clips before i took a seat okay. it really doesn't taste nice so try and avoid eat, tasting it it does give a little bit of a sting, but it works really nicely. So we smear it up real nice on top there. on the lips for me. Okay. Then a little of ice pack is gonna help numb you up a bit quicker. Okay. What's your looks pretty? <laughs> See when you smile? Mm. See. Mm. Love it. Beautiful, eh? Yeah. I've kept your natural shape but I've obviously given it that volume. You'll see more when you sit up. that bottom up. Well, I think I'll put some stuff on your nose that you're going to wear. Can't stop looking at my lips. They're gorgeous, eh? <laughs> yeah. 
I can't wait. Like tomorrow you're gonna wake up and they're gonna mm -hmm. look like huge. Mm -hmm. um, but then obviously like the next day they'll still be a bit big. Set you up. Not too big, not too. It's perfectly fine. I used a full syringe. I actually use one point two of a syringe. Really? Yeah. And how much do you usually use? Or like less than one. one. Oh. I normally use like zero point nine, but I use like one point two on you. <laughs> this is Dr. Jess, <laughs> and she's on the gave me my new set of lips. Oh. So beautiful. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'm so happy. I'm over the moon exceeded my expectations they are gorgeous let's show you okay so we're gonna find a photo of you relaxed then we will find a photo of you relaxed again and have a look at the difference it's zoomed in there So your shape, we just enhanced a little bit to get rid of your sad looking mm. over there. We gave you a little bit of a cupid's bow but not nothing hectic. We got rid of your lines. So if we zoom in over there, we can see what we've done. Take a look at that and then take a look like that. So we lifted your corner of your mouth just to find a bit of your cupid's bow filled out the wrinkles on the bottom lip over there you can see that they're nice and plumped out now hydrated mm. and not over filled but filled enough yeah. they are perfect and Too perfect. beautiful <laughs> and symmetrical and they suit you so well. Look at that crispy border. Yeah, they're not too big for my face. They are <laughs> not too big for your face. Good morning. So it is the following. Mm, it's not the following day. Um, it's like two days later after my appointment. I didn't vlog yesterday. Um, now I'm, I'm back home. I was supposed to actually come back home on Monday, but um, I ended up just coming back home today. It's Tuesday. So no. <laughs> what am I saying? It's Wednesday. I was supposed to come back home on Tuesday. Um, no. <laughs> Sorry, guys. I just woke up. So, it's Wednesday. I was supposed to come back on Monday. But I ended up coming back on Tuesday, which is yesterday. I came back yesterday at around 2 o'clock. Um, yeah, and this load shedding has really just had me in a chokehold because I need to shoot videos and stuff. And my ring light works with like a two pin plug it's not those usb ones that i can just plug into my speaker or my laptop like when the lights are off i can't create any type of content so i was just really panicking yesterday because i had so many videos to shoot and i just didn't have the time to pick up the camera and record but um i just want to let you like give you guys an update in terms of my lip fillers so yesterday my lips were so swollen like I think they started swelling at around 11 o'clock on Monday and that was no no 11 p.m. 11 p.m. on Mondays so like in the evening my lips started like getting bigger and girl they were just looking so big um, I was even like oh my gosh how am I gonna like run around tomorrow do my errands go outside with lips that are this big so then um what happened was that following day i checked my lips in the mirror they were still very big but you know i realized that it wasn't too bad but i stayed indoors the whole day actually yesterday um and then today here i am and this is how my lips look they're still a bit swollen and dr jess did say that my lips might be still swollen like on the third day and that is today so they are still swollen but not as swollen as they were yesterday mm -hmm. i will put a picture of like how swollen they were yesterday um i did take a picture like at night when i was literally just realized that my lips are starting to get swollen and then also i didn't show you guys the you know package that dr jess gave me um she also sent me um a message on whatsapp on how to like 
careful my lips and what I should and shouldn't do so I'm gonna put it up here as well so you guys can see as I read so it basically just says do you expect swelling and bruising and I do have a bit of swelling and I think I have like a bruise somewhere on top of my lip um, do you take time I, I don't know how to pronounce that like Tylenol for mild pain so like I can't take painkillers don't massage unless instructed she did say that i shouldn't massage my lips and that i should just go to her if i need my lips massaged um don't remain in the sun for 72 hours i've been indoors so that's great don't apply makeup for 12 hours i applied makeup last night and it was over 24 hours so that's perfect do apply a cold compress she did give me a cold compress in the package which i will be showing you guys and i have been putting it on but not as often as she says i should um do contact us if needed i did contact them for like one or two things and they did respond respond um don't drink alcohol for 12 hours don't smoke for 12 hours don't exercise for 24 hours this one hit me hard because i was literally planning to go to the gym straight after my lip filler appointment so when i heard this one i was just like eh, you know problem but anyway, um, yeah, this is just like the post filler after came. So let me show you guys what she gave me in the package. Okay, so I'm still in bed, as you guys can see. I've had load shedding twice this morning, so please forgive me for still being in bed at this time. My morning is going quite slow because of load shedding. Like I said, um, my day is just going very slow. So this is the package she gave me. Right. And then inside of the package, it's like lips refined it's like a pamphlet like a booklet you know with like information and pictures as well you know so that's great i did look through it actually just like scan through it i'm not 100 percent sure what this is i think it's just like a cute thing that i can keep i don't know i'm actually gonna ask her what it is but um this came in the package as well so cute and then she gave me this is the ice pack or the ice thingy that i should put on my lips you guys saw this in my boomerang you guys saw this in my boomerang on instagram so this is basically what I apply on my lips. A cold compress. This is what it is. But yeah, that's the package she gave me. And um, three days after lip fillers, how do I feel? Do I regret it? Like, what's on my mind? So um, I don't regret getting these lip fillers at all, actually. Um, it's better than my tattoo, actually. Uh, when I got my tattoo, this big tattoo... A day after i was like regretting it i'm like oh my gosh like did i make the right decision and whatever but then the following day afterwards i started loving my tattoo but with this i did not regret it not even a single bit after getting it um i think also because i didn't do anything major you know my lips still look the same as before but not entirely as you guys could see in the before and after pictures that jess was showing you guys on um camera yeah obviously still this is not how my lips will look like they're still swollen so this is not the final look this is not the final result you guys are gonna have to wait for the next vlog to see um you know to see how my lips end up looking like the end result after the whole healing process the reason why she was asking me to smile is because before when i smiled um it it showed too much of my gums you know like too much of my gums were showing and that's one thing i didn't really necessarily like but i still liked my smile before like you guys know i'm always smiling i i like my smile you know but um that's just something that i wanted to correct a bit so she did um do the lip fillers on top to also like try and hide the um the gums a bit and not to have them show as much as they did and that worked as well as you could see in the clip um but yeah overall the experience um what i would rate it out of 10 i would definitely say 9 out of 10 actually i'd say 9 out of 10 nothing out of 10 because um I don't like the fact that like your lips 
get swollen a day after you know so yeah guys um the lip filler journey is still going on because we are still going through the healing process we are still swollen but other than that um i will put dr jess's uh details down below in the description box so her business page instagram and her contact details as well will be down below in the description box and yeah i'm gonna start my day um i'm also gonna end the vlog here so thank you guys so much for watching this video if you liked it don't forget to give it a big fat big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below for more content okay um yeah and uh i'll see you guys in my next video Mwah.